Hi everyone, welcome to our fourth week of Advent. I'm Zach Rockers, Director of Campus Ministry here at Elias Catholic. And I'm Father Paul Clark, Chaplain here at Elias Catholic. So like I said, we're in our fourth week of Advent and there's something uh, pretty unique about this fourth week this year. Father, would you like to elaborate? Yeah, this, there's not much to elaborate because this year, uh, the fourth Sunday, we've only got a couple of hours. Uh, this evening, we'll move into our uh, celebration of, of Christmas and Christmas Eve. And, um, but, you know, it's okay thinking this is so short, this is so small. Uh, our God, who is, is huge in this celebration of Christmas, becomes small. Uh, and that's part of the, the majesty and mystery of it. Uh, our God can do a lot of things with, with little time. Absolutely. And so we really just appreciate you making this journey through Advent with us. We really focused on presence, the presence of Christ this Christmas. And, you know, that first week we encouraged you to um, really prepare for the presence of Christ. The second week we focused on receiving the presence of Christ. And the third was being the presence of Christ to the world. And I think in the midst of all the busyness and chaos as we're preparing for Christmas, um, we really want to invite you guys to focus on peace. A very simple um, but very deeply profound virtue that we want to see. Father, yeah. what do you think about peace? Everything that our peer ministers have been walking us through in this Advent season is, is leading to this fourth week, peace. And uh, I think in today's gospel, we're given a great image of that where, where Mary receives this massive news from, from Gabriel. Um, but it's fast, it's a quick message. And then, uh, but she has been preparing. Uh, she receives and, and she responds. She is then uh, that, that love, that, that joy. And, and that's what brings peace, ultimately. It's not the absence of uh, everything on our checklist being done or everyone we're around being at peace. Uh, it's that, that we are entering into the pattern that we've established in this uh, walk through Advent. Uh, that's the fruit of that is peace. So our challenge for you this very short but very meaningful fourth week, be present right, and let the peace of Christ fill your hearts at the end of this Advent season. And we really hope that you feel prepared to have the best Christmas ever. Happy Advent.